See, I like also like I think I get I get like a monobrow, so I have to do it for my eyebrows as well. Yeah, so Electro Razor does it for me. Hey Leo, haven't seen you for a while. What A rows and B rows? Okay, you have a unibrow, razor blade a lot. The problem with that is um, the stubble. I don't like the stubble. Oh, but bear in mind, I've been using tweezers and getting them waxed for like 15 years. So, round there is so in terms of uh, nerve receptors, probably isn't as bad. Your cartilage is broken in the center, so it's painful. Ow, that must be painful, Pete. You thought I was alone? No, no, you're not alone. Now, I, I, I tried using a razor blade for my uh, unibrow once, uh, and it came out so stubbly, it was like, nah, never again. I'm perfectly happy to either get them waxed or to pluck them myself. And I'm I'm fine with that. Also, hey, hey, Will. Hugh Will, sorry. You tweeze your brows to get rid of them entirely. I, I tend to give it a shaping as well, round here. In fact, I, I did the middle bit myself on Friday, but I didn't do round the edges, so I've got a few loose hairs around the edge. Also, to anyone who doesn't usually watch me play Dead by Daylight, usually in game, I concentrate, when I'm playing kid, I concentrate quite a bit. So if I miss chat, I apologise. I will catch up when I can. You have an eyebrow waxes. Do you need eyebrows for anything? Not really. Nah. They make you look cool. That's about it. You have all these kits. You have an, what, an eyebrow waxing kit, a chest waxing kit, a leg waxing kit, an intimate waxing kit, a hair waxing kit, a feet waxing kit. And everything waxing kit. Alright, things standard. This could be America. No, it's not America. It's probably somewhere like Eastern European. Let's go to the center. <laughs> I went down there, but okay. The problem with the game is I don't like the map itself. Kick. I'm just gonna have a laugh in this game. A lot of people are gonna be hiding, I reckon. <laughs> Spin burst away. <laughs> Down it goes. Go around this way. There goes my lullaby. I get a hit here. There's my pallet. Good, good. Just a long time ago. I mean, at some point, I've had pretty much every part of my body waxed. Um, I, I, I don't. I actually don't mind waxing. I see someone over there. Nice try. Back out. Let's go upstairs. Got bits. Has he ever had a bikini wax? Not a bikini wax, no, because we men don't have bikinis. Hey. <laughs> nice. 
Nice. And that's basement as well. Does this, does Hazzy wear bikinis? No, I do not wear bikinis. I've had, I've had chest up before. Does Sally do much anything of a chase? Because I haven't noticed when it does. Uh, if he successfully zaps someone, they can't do any, like, actually, like, throw down pallets or vault for two seconds. Um, if uh, you get uh, into tier three madness, you obviously have to use the cooldown to get it off. So let's shot. Before we come downstairs. There's David. There's someone downstairs then. We're ahead running. I'm gonna go down here and come back. I don't know if I get the antagonist fives and the protected fives. Oh yeah, I'm definitely the antagonist out of us too. By 100%. Thank you, Spin Curse. I'll take that. Uh, I was sorry about you and Baz. So. Yeah, that's right. There is somewhere out there some sort of odd fanfic. Yeah. Nothing lewd or anything like that. It's just a bit more funny. Yeah. I hear someone. Okay, go back. Hey, Jake. I think it's gone off to. He's disappeared. Okay, I V D S. If he hits it, obviously. Now we're giving about this mode is hitting D S is ridiculously hard. But he's always in little chatty modes. <laughs> Someone's over here. Ram man with down to Jen. Yes, yes, it does. Problem is, I don't know the map too well. That. Upstairs. Over there, get that. How's he? I found a new loving music, Barry. What's that? What new love is this? I see a Jake. It's David, okay. He's panicking. They have missed both of us. thing. He's got a pallet somewhere. We've got a battle? Cool. Eurobeat. Not the first time I've heard of Eurobeat. Up there. Oh. 
I might remove Jake now. Yeah, uh, people was doing one after the other, not waiting for three. That makes sense. Hey, David. Yeah, I'd like to go have a look. <laughs> you don't make that. Kick that gen over there. That's Jake. <laughs> nice. Jake's out as well. I just want to go over Jake over to... I know things gone for the save, but that's fine, because I want Jake out. Only means even. <laughs> does it now, Rose? Does it? Hello, over there. <laughs> and a few gents. So, all the gents over that side are done, so I can focus on over here now. Honey! Yes, I can't get that now. Nice. I want to know more of the emo language. I mean, I'm. I will listen. Down here. <laughs> Go for David. He's probably get. Someone's going for the save. I'll keep the gen up here. To be fair, American Rose, from what I've seen from you, you're always up to something. Let's <laughs> go down somewhere this way. That gem. That is a bad place to be doing stuff. <laughs> Boots and Cats. I like their name. Alex, is this you? You're British Rose, that's right. <laughs> so you hit it, fair play. <laughs> nice. Sorry, British Rose. I forgot. See what I mean by when I play games, I can sometimes forget what's happening. Back look there. Up there, okay. Yeah, Rosalina is American Rose, and Rose D&D is British Rose. I think all the gens are off now. Means I could do this, do a big boy shock over here. <laughs> I think I got a spin burst, so. <laughs> that paint's gone. Because I know she doesn't have dead arcs, you spin burst, it should be easy now. Just and I hook her there. American B A rose and B rose, yes. 
I must not mention any sort of like any rank. That's just letters commonly associated with the countries. We should point that out. Go downstairs. this on that gen. <laughs> I don't in there but I'll kick the gen. So let's go for the save. Hello. Straight into me, nice. Saving it at your DS. Nope. Ask them out. Number two. Someone's over here. Oh, congrats, you did it, Jen. I see scratches over here. Break this. Give me a shock. <laughs> There's one pallet left here. I get hit here, so she should have gone back and used the pallets, in my opinion. Get out, Garni! No, you want to clearly avoid the matter. Yes, yes. Call him out like that, American Rose, British Rose. I wonder where David is, because he's in... Uh, I, this could be uh, just a hatch game. He's not over here. I, mean, I found the hatch. Let's get upstairs. Problem with this, oh, the doors are miles apart. It might be just the 3k then. On that door. So I tell you this is closed, but I. Yes, I trust you. Ooh, interesting. He might get out here. I'm quite a distance from the door. So I do this. <laughs> oh, hello. Go use your big boy dead art. Use it. There we go. GG. Ah, it's impossible skill check, doctor. Move to PC and get out of bed. Okay, no worries. Good or bad? Yeah, GG. <laughs> you go some tripe and try to Yeah, get some sleep, Rose. If it's, if it's nearly five o'clock in the morning for you, get some sleep. Night American Rose. Also, that made things easier because we called British Rose just Rose again. Uh, that was a perfect game as well. For like 32k, perfect game. 